Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Leo for the month of March or from the time you view this video. These events could be in play. Um, please keep in mind it is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't, check your other placements. Your messages could be there and if not, simply check back in the following week when I put out a new message for your sign. And so, um, hmm, let's see what we have here. Okay. I think I'm going to begin here and I'm going to move over here after. So what we have is, um, there is regret over a loss. I mean, you have other op uh, options right now, but the one you still desire is that one in the past. There was... Uh, devotion here. You have the devotion card. So you would have did anything to that person uh, or not to. <laughs> you would have done anything for that person. Okay. With the devotion card. Um, I feel like there's still passion for that person and um, a desire uh, again to um, perhaps bring this back to life. It may have ended uh, because of the house. Um, and I feel that's your inner house, a part of you uh, perhaps that um, maybe felt insecure. Um, it could be that you're just feeling insecure now with regards to this, um, to this loss. You need to, with the house, um, in this situation you're in, you need to ask yourself why it's happening and what needs to change about this situation um, to bring your inner world back into balance again. Now, if we go up here again, um, this can be community and you also have the community card so someone very close to you we already know that by the devotion card the book is closed something was released with the peacock um, but also with the book there's information you don't know or don't have or can't see um, there's like mystery here um, we have the perspective and the chicken. So the chicken is about finding your voice. Maybe you did this. Maybe you found the voice, um, but it was based on your perspective, um, because of a belief, because the subconscious is here, something you believed. Uh, based on the experiences in your life journey that have shaped you up until that moment that that happened. This was a faded event. There's something here that is to be learned from this. Now, we, that brings me back here because it's telling you, ask yourself, why this happened and I believe you would have to go back to the belief system to the past to your perspective and in understanding why it happened it will allow for a new perspective uh, it will allow for the pieces that are hidden now in the book it will allow for these pieces um, for you to see them clearly and uh, align them up, put them all in their place. You were really afraid of having to do with the balance or the give and take in this commitment. There was a 
a lot of fears. You have you have the nine of swords energy in the past, having to do with the commitment and the give and take in that uh, commitment. Um, you felt like you were the victim. Now I'm saying you, but I mean, it could be, this could be the, oops, sorry. This could be the other person's energy. Somebody here felt like they were a victim. And based on that belief, uh, which was born of past experiences, they may have ended the relationship, or at least it was in part responsible for that relationship um, falling apart. So that person uh, felt like they were being deceived, like someone was taking advantage of them, like someone uh, maybe uh, shut them out or, um, or they in fact, because they felt this way, shut this person out. But there's a deeper uh, issue here. It, they're showing me the uh, they're showing me the uh, the mushrooms. It's like a lot of issues that stem from the same source. Now, there were consequences for the decision, and the consequences have you here. Um, and and understand that you will have another decision to make. Um, the wheel is bringing in a new opportunity um, with regards to this situation. You will have to decide. But remember that for every decision, uh, I mean, if you if you live back here in this fear, um, if you haven't figured this out, why it happened, then you know uh, you you that's going to determine what your decision is going to be if you figured out what happens again it will determine what your what your decision is going to be with regards to this new opportunity because i see it here with the wheel and it could be that you are now willing to talk to this person or it could be that you are looking uh, and they are willing to now hear you out but this is happening and it is happening for a reason and you know um, you need to figure this out before you get to here you both of you um, there's still there's like a really strong attraction you're both very attracted one to the other. You see it here. You may have a special connection to this person, as they do to you. Soulmates, twin flames. Um, you are most certainly wanting to fight uh, or somebody is, somebody wants to fight for this relationship to try to gain higher ground here. Um, this Six of Cups is creating new memories. It's what somebody wants to do. And the attraction is still very strongly felt here. The lovers. This is something that could happen really quick in the future, uh, you could get news of a sudden that somebody suddenly now wants to um, work through the issues that somebody uh, wants to offer the cup, work through the issues um, to bring uh, these two people closer together. And there is a strong possibility of this happening because I have it here. You see, I have a reunion, a celebration. I have somebody expressing their feelings. This is all happening quickly. In the very near future. Doing the right thing.
yeah you know don't i have that self-sabotaging behavior here um there's a need to recognize where that behavior is coming from you may be uh you or they could be wanting to apologize for that behavior they may now see because this is asking them that's exactly what this is all about seeing why they react the way they do you know why they do the things they do why they, they think those thoughts um it's going back to the past that they will find that answer the sad embrace this is somebody who is feeling like a victim and um, this is what this card is about here in this deck and possibly here also inner house is insecure are you suffering over your suffering do you feel that life is treating you unfairly and that you've been robbed or deprived of what you're entitled to do you long for a love that eludes you this card asks well if you hold on to your perception of unfairness which is what we have in these cards here if you hold on to that perception and we have that card of perception here in the overall energies then you'll find yourself trapped in its tight grip and this is what I'm saying there's going to be consequences uh, for decisions that you make here um, you need to find out why that's what it's telling you right off that's the central issue that's what you got to know it's you got to find out why you or them whoever is in that energy you need to um, you need to be responsible for your part in something or they do whoever this is it's about being responsible um, for our actions you you have the um, come together card and so this you know um, leads me with what I see here and you also have the wish coming true you get the opportunity to do the right thing here we go again knight of cups again we have it here this is repeating energy thinking of you know of going forward with this trying to gain a new perspective it's what you need to do but in order to get that you need to go back okay when you do when you got it all figured out love is coming to you it needs to be shared this card says and to be expressed so maybe for someone they did not express it they did not share it in the past and they're telling you it needs to be shared it needs to be expressed and receiving this card is a sign that you're on the path to discover love in all of its forms of expression romantic familial unconditional and spiritual love involves a give and take between you and a significant other this card assures you that love has or soon will be coming your way love has come calling you will be given another chance so get this figured out you or them needs to get this figured out before this reunion happens
I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings.